Hey, what's up everyone? Uh, it's over. My Barbenheimer day is complete. I finally just saw Barbie. I just got out of the theater right now. So fun fact, this is actually the second time I'm seeing this movie. I actually saw this movie back in February. I can say that now without getting into trouble, but I saw this as a test screening. So I saw the movie somewhat whole but it was missing you know obviously a lot of the music and some of the graphics and special effects um they definitely buttoned it up a little bit more now so they did a lot of uh, editing from the last time i saw it but overall i thought the movie was just entertaining and fun and greta gerwig really i think solidifies herself as the female voice of this generation um yes you have a lot of like kind of feminist type of messaging here, but you also get a lot of messages of self-importance, um, you know, self-awareness, where one belongs in life, uh, a lot of, uh, you know, plays on societal views and all that, things like that. It's also just very smart and intelligent. And I think that's one of the downfalls of this movie, because I think people are going into this movie thinking it's going to be just a, a rompy, good old fun time you know, that you can go out with, uh, catch a movie with your girlfriends and all that. But it's a very smart movie, and that's what Greta Gerwig does. Um, a lot of it reminds me of Elf, um, kind of like fish out of water situations. A lot of like, I don't know, I don't want to compare it to like the Lego movie, but I feel like there's some comparisons there. Big, uh, Pee Wee's Big Adventure. <laughs> um, there's a lot of influences I can see from Greta and um, obviously her husband, Noah Baumbach, who helped write the script and all that. But it definitely has their sensibilities in it. So if you're familiar with Greta's work, kind of like Lady Bird, um, then it's definitely her type of movie. If you're familiar with Noah Baumbach, especially like White Noise, then you could definitely sense, you know, his stylings and his voice in the script as well. But I'll go further into it later on in a review that I'll do separately on the channel, but I think overall it was very entertaining, it was fun, but I do think a lot of people are going to get confused and not, this is not the movie that I think a lot of people are going to expect it to be. It's also not really a movie geared towards kids. I feel like uh, more of the teenagers and the adults will get a lot of it, will understand it a lot more. And I feel like, uh, you know, I saw a lot of younger kids with their moms and sisters you know, like coming out to see the movie and stuff like that, which is fine. I think it's going to be a lot of that this weekend, but I think it's really the adults that are going to understand a lot of the messaging here. Um, and I could just spend so much time going deep into it, but it's getting late and I'm going to head on home. Uh, I got like another 40 minute drive home. So I'm curious to those of you who've seen it, by now or are planning to watch it let me know what your thoughts are what you're expecting if uh let me know if this was the type of movie you were expecting would love to hear your thoughts in the comments and as always like subscribe all that good stuff i will catch you later on in later a video talking about this movie and uh everyone's going to be talking about this movie this weekend so i'll catch you all later stay cool stay classy stay safe peace out y'all thanks